Hi guys, right, so today we're going to be making the ceviche, ceviche, whatever you, however you call it. So here are my wild red shrimp, they um, are from Iceland guys. These are lovely tomatoes, lime, I'm using rocket instead of cilantro, lovely ripe avocados, red onion and a cucumber. First of all, we're going to take the shells off these and dice them up. Right, so we'll just cut this bag open, I just want to de-shell them. A little bowl for the shells. Right, I don't know why I've got this big plate. <laughs> They're not that big, but never mind. Right then, so we'll take the shells off these. They're already cleaned. Um, so we we'll just literally need to peel them off. One lovely clean shrimp. Right, guys, so that's them all de shelled there. So now we're just going to literally cut them in half because they will shrink in the pan. I'm going to cook them in the pan first. Make sure they're thoroughly cooked. Right, we'll go over and take them to the pan now, get them cooked off. Right, so we've got the pan on the heat. I'm just going to spray it with some highlight. light. And then we'll go in with some shrimp. Guys, mm. right? So now, guys, we're going to get with chop on. Uh, I think I'll start with the onions. Probably just use one onion, guys. Got the onion nice and finely chopped. Put those in the bowl here. I've never ever had this guys but I thought it looked absolutely delicious when I was watching Steven's sushi. Now I'm going to do the cucumber. Right so I don't know how much cucumber to use. Just go there. I'm not putting all that in. Just use that. Now some tomatoes. Lovely vine tomatoes. Um, see what one looks like first. Don't know which way to cut this. So it looks like so far guys now i'm going to chop some rocket chop some of this up get a handful out oh love rocket as well just get it all squished together that's lovely when you chop it Now 
now I need a line. Some lime juice in. Oh, got to cut around my fingers and bone in. Get some salt and pepper. Pinch of salt. Pinch of pepper. And then we mix it. Give all this lovely goodness a stir. Look at that. Lovely and fresh. Yum. I'm going to go and cook, uh, cook me tortillas so they go nice and crisp. Um, and then the avocado goes in at the last minute. That's the last thing to go in. But I'll put that in once the tortillas are done. Oh God, this smells absolutely divine. Have a little taste test. Whoa. Mmm. Mm. Wow. Look at that. Yummy, yummy. So let's go and do the tortillas, guys. Right, so we've got the pan on, guys. I need to get some oil. Put that, about that much oil in. Let it heat up. So you want them roughly like that, as long as they go nice and hard, crisp. Right, the um, tacos, the tortillas are done. Now I'm going to chop up this lovely ripened avocado. Ho, ho, ho. Lovely. There you go. One. Come out so easy, guys, when they're uh, lovely and ripe. I don't know how much you're supposed to put in, like. Mmm. Mmm. God, I can't wait to eat this, everyone. <gasps> That's avocado in. Give it a mix. Oh, God. Quite luxurious, this, like. Even though it's, like, quite cheap to make. Feels like you're in the Mediterranean. <laughs> right, I'm going to go and get... There you go. That's it there. Oh. Delicious. I'm going to go and get me um, set up done. I'll be with you in a second, guys, to eat this delicious ceviche. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel, Eat With Coral Blush. I'm so, so, so excited to try this, guys. I added the shrimp. I forgot to put the shrimp on while I was recording, but I let it cool down, and I've added the shrimp here. <laughs> I'm so excited. Uh, first of all, Yolanda Rodriguez, thank you so much. I'm using my new ring light right now. It's a lovely one. It's much better than the other one. It even goes multicolored. It like does like disco light effect and everything. I love it. So, and it's lush to like move it to how I want to move it without it just because I had to just balance it before as you know, kept falling. So it's just so solid now. Thank you so much, Yolanda. And especially thank you so much for um, giving the boys money each to... Um, for the birthdays that's very very kind of you i put a little clip in when i told them this morning what you had done they were super excited and very grateful so we're going to take them to smith's toy store at the weekend so they can pick some toys with them so that was very very generous of you thank you so so much once again you've been amazing right boys i've got a surprise for you do you know um yolanda mm -hmm. she's a lovely subscriber um well she's put 25 pound each for you, for your birthdays in my PayPal. Isn't that very nice of her? Uh -huh. So what do you want to say? Thank you. Thank you so much. 
<laughs> so I think a trip to Smith's is in order, eh? Because mm-hmm. Spencer's was actually a third dinosaur you wanted, wasn't it? And the pop thing, is that what yeah. you're going to get? The new, what was it? The new dinosaur with the big claws? Yeah, I think, yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyways, we'll have a look around Smith's, eh? But that was very, very kind of her, wasn't it? To give you both £25 for your birthdays. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> right, so let's dig into this, eh? I've got a big blackcurrant juice here, guys. <sighs> right, let's get in. I'm just going to eat it like how Stephen ate it. Like I say, because I watched his. Look, these are lovely and crisp the tortillas. You literally... Just load this goodness up and we're taught you. Ready? Wow, is that? It's going to be sloppy, I know. I nearly wasn't going to put shrimp or chicken in. No, I was thinking about doing chicken. Just had a bite of that shrimp there. I'm not glad I put it in. Mmm. Super fresh and... Oh. Mm. Just everything inside is delicious. I need to go and get a tea towel because I can just feel loads of things on my face but I'm enjoying it too much guys oh look at that mm. but yeah Alice will love this We'll have another um, little meal, first time made, smashed it again, lush, it's like a proper like holiday food. These are really nice but I can tell you know, I made for uh, tortillas like but I don't know if I'm going to be able to eat for. Wow. Mm. Mm. These would be good for ASMR. One of my subscribers has been asking us when I'm going to do another ASMR. I don't know.
Mm. I could have maybe um, cut them shrimp into three. They've stayed like quite big. I've put just the right amount of um, lime juice on anymore and I think I would have overpowered it. Oh my god, I'm just busy uh, editing my video guys and it stopped at 7 minutes 7. My storage on my phone is full. I needed to delete loads of stuff and my phone just stopped recording halfway through that video. This is like what I had left. I like cut off. Got one tortilla left and still all that. I'm absolutely full. I can't manage another thing. I can't believe that's happened. <laughs> but anyways, you've seen a few little mouthfuls. <laughs> It was absolutely delicious. I highly recommend if you like all the ingredients in this, go and make it yourself. It's really, really good. Um, so I'm a little bit gutted about that. So I'm glad I have got the little cooking portion to add to the start of this. And that'll make it like a half decent video. But absolutely delicious, guys. If you like that short but sweet little video, please hit the thumbs up button. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified of future uploads. Hey, hi. <laughs> Two years later. Bye.